After two years of fighting against the crematorium, White Marsh neighbors hoping their concerns are finally being heard. A county council member made a change the neighbors say could bring the funeral home's plans to build that to a screeching halt now. Kelsey Kushner has been on this story from the start and has much more on what this can mean now. The proposed crematorium is going right there at the marked sign. For Caroline Coleman O'Neill, the proposed plans for the crematorium get close to home. My family is right on the other side of that forest. A little too close to home. For the past two years, neighbors in White Marsh have been pushing back on proposed plans for Evans Funeral Chapel to build a funeral chapel and crematory off Philadelphia Road, citing concerns with traffic and pollution. The area just doesn't make sense. The residents, there's literally residents that backs up right to the property. Of course, the daycare center right across the street. Back in 2023, WJZ was at a meeting with the funeral owner, Charlie Evans, who assured neighbors that pollution levels would meet the state's legal limits. But since then, there's been major pushback about the proposal. There are no EPA standards for a crematory and what it's shoving out into the air. But hope may be on the horizon for residents. Just last month, Baltimore County Council Member David Marks made a zoning change rezoning the property of the proposed crematory to allow for commercial development, saying in a statement, I made the zoning change to attempt to block the crematorium as requested by dozens of residents. And neighbors are hoping the changes will bring the plans of the crematorium to a screeching halt. It feels like a sigh of relief because there, right now, under the zoning on that property being CB, there is no um, there is no right for a funeral establishment, neither by special exception. So we feel like that's off the table. 